I, I was certainly very, very anxious. It was, uh, you know, really difficult to try to concentrate on two things at the same time. So, you know, our brains are not meant to be multitaskers. And, uh, you know, uh, obviously I couldn't spell while, correctly while I was even texting. It was hard concentrating on two things at the same time. Distracted driving has become a considerable problem for law enforcement across the province. Uh, certainly we've seen with the increased use of smartphones, etc., drivers become more and more distracted as they try to do their daily, conduct their daily life. And certainly we've seen in particular with their, our youth and our young drivers using cell phones as they become part of their lifestyle. And we've seen a considerable increase to the point where we've added distracted or inattentive driving to one of the big four um, causation factors of serious and fatal collisions across the You can tell when someone is texting behind the wheel when you're, you're in a car, they aren't keeping up the traffic, they're not paying attention, and, and if you're looking in your rear view mirror and you know someone's texting behind you, I'm always afraid someone's going to hit me, not see uh, a stop sign, a red light, or pedestrians, and, uh, and that actually translates into, uh, into injuries or, or fatalities. I travel the highways every day, pretty well, all day long I'm on the road, and uh, a lot of people don't get it. A lot of people just don't know how serious it is until they're actually involved in, in a collision because they were on a device, or they might have been a victim of someone else being on a device, and then they see how serious it is, and that really strikes it uh, deep into them and then they decide to get rid of it but I've, I've driven alongside of vehicles in a police cruiser and a person has been texting and not even know that I'm alongside of them. It clearly is uh, a growing problem and we're seeing it in our trauma unit uh, with a number of uh, and, and other emergency departments uh, really around the world are, are seeing it. Uh, so this is something that we need to capitalize on now and, uh, and help people to understand the ramifications of, of texting and driving.